What's up guys, Golov here again. On today's video, I want to talk about a concept which is very, very, very important. I don't care if you have 100 strategies that are working in forex trading or 2 million strategies. Until you are able to master concepts like this before, I can even consider you like somebody who is on the way of making money in forex. Trust me, I have been through the same circle and a strategy in forex is just about 20%. 80% of what will make you money in forex trading come boils down to trading psychology and factors like this. That is why on today's video, I want us to talk about the balance between money, time, and motivation when it comes to forex trading. Trust me, this is going to blow your mind. So make sure you stay to the end of the video. This is going to blow your mind and you will see what you've been missing or what you've been missing in your trading uh, career. Time year equates to freedom, all right? As we'll be going ahead, you see time year equates to freedom. So we're talking about what? The balance of money, time, and motivation when it comes to Forex trading. You can also call this the life cycle. The life cycle of success when it comes to Forex trading. And it's going to make sense when we see in this couple, uh, in these other slides, all right? So I think let's just change the color of this slice to something a little bit white so that you can see my background. Uh, let me go on forms and hit this one on white. Perfect, perfect. So what are we talking about? We are talking about the balance between money, freedom, and motivation when it comes to forex trading. Or the balance between money, time, time equates to freedom. The balance between money, time, and motivation because it becomes a point in time where when you have the money you have the money you lack the motivation or you don't have the time to eat the money or sometimes you you'll be able to have the motivation you'll be able to have the time but the money wouldn't be there because you don't have the skills but we're going to be able to cover all of this on this video and cover the myths that are around this particular topic and let you know which way you can go as a beginner all right let you know which way you can go as a beginner Perfect. Okay, to even begin, let's just assume, because for me, it took me three years to be profitable in Forex trading. Maybe for you, it's going to take uh, longer than that or a little bit shorter than that. But an average person will take between three years, between two to three years for you to start making money in Forex trading, for you to be profitable in Forex trading. That is the reality, all right? So let me just take myself as an example. You can see here, I have year one, year two, and year three, all right? Uh, let me also change the color of my pen so that we can be able to see. Good. You can see here, I have year one, year two, and year three. So let's just assume year one for me, maybe this was 2016, maybe this was 2019 or 2017 or something. Then year, th year three, maybe that was 2000, 2015, 2016, 2017, or 2016, 17, and 18. All right? So this was my first year of Forex trading. This was my first year of Forex trading. And in my first year of Forex trading, I had the time. All right. I had the time to study. I had the time to look for those keys. I had the time to be able to ask for questions. I had the time to be able to work on myself. Another thing I also had, another thing I also had at this level, I had the motivation. I used to watch all motivational videos. By that time, I was in, uh, I was in Cameroon, I remember. So I used to watch all traders from the UK, from South Africa, from US. I used to download all these videos. I used to have Forex motivational videos about 100 or 200 of them in my con not only on youtube but i would download and store them on my computer and i watch them on a daily basis so i had the motivation i knew it was something which was going to change my life i knew it was an industry that was going to make money all right so i had the motivation let's let's also change the thickness of our pen and i think black is going to be fine so that it doesn't confuse us let's pick black so i had the time i had the motivation but since by that time I was just studying, uh, I was just starting on Forex or I was just still learning how to trade Forex, I didn't have the money. You see, that is why you see, if you, if you know what is a triangle, all right, if you know what's a triangle, on this triangle, the longer side, the longer sides are this and this and the shorter side is what? It's money. So I had motivation, I had time and the other thing I didn't have was money because I was just starting in forex trading and I didn't know what I was doing and I was still learning. So this was still a learning phase. Perfect. Let's go to year two. On year two, at least by this time, I had already traded on a demo account and I started depositing $100, $200 with uh, XM or with uh, uh, IQ options and I was already trading, all right? So this is my year two. This is my year two right here. 
on my year two you can see on my triangle uh, everything turns to do what to balance up a little bit so i still had my motivation i still had my motivation on year two i, st I knew very well that okay i was gonna get there one day even though i was still blown accounts on uh still on year two i still had the time and by this point in time even though i was still make i'll make 100 dollars lost 150 make 200 lost two. so at this time i was already i was already trading life so trading life even if i just make five dollars is money right so that is why the money at the, the money angle of it or the money side of the triangle is not more than this everything is equal on year two perfect come to year three on year three let's just assume this was 2019 this is where I started making money in forex trading. This is where I actually started seeing profits in forex trading. On year three, you can see what is the shortest side here. Let's start with the longer side. I had money. All right. I was already making reasonable money in forex trading. I also had the time. I also had the time. You can see this will only come in with freedom. So the, you can see my traveling only starts in 20 by the 2019, 2019 going upward. So this you have the freedom to travel you have the freedom to actually do what you want that's why they used to say any idiot or any fool can be rich any person can be rich you just need to be lucky you can any person can be rich you just need to be lucky but not any person can be worthy all right worth comes with freedom any idiot any person can be rich you just need to be lucky you can win a lottery today and you become a millionaire that is why they say any idiot can become a millionaire but not any person can become worthy all right wealth comes with freedom and by this point in time i already had i had the money i had the freedom and what the only thing i lacked now was the motivation <laughs> let me explain what i mean so the only thing i lack you can see not that i lacked i still have it because you can see i have the smaller side of the triangle is this section all right so i still have the motivation but not as much as the money and the time not as much as the money and the freedom let me explain what let me explain what i mean at this point at this point in time that is why they say they, they say if you are still very very excited if you are still very thrilled you are still very excited with trading then you are still an amateur if you are still very excited with forex trading then you are still a loser profitable forex trading is boring <laughs> that is i don't even i'm not sounding pessimistic but profitable forex trading is very boring in the sense that you already have a system that is working you already have a system which you have tested over and over and over and over because in forex trading data is energy you've already have that you've had that data for two three four years and you've been testing over and over and you already have a system that is working so the only thing you're just doing you're just implementing that system that system every day so when you keep it becomes more like insane, insanity right because insanity is when you do everything you do the same thing every day and expect different results so in our case it's a little bit different because we just keep doing the same thing you come open your chart you just put in the same strategy you just fine tuning the same strategy and everything so it becomes boring in a, in a, in a sense that i'm not too, still too hyped as if it was my first year of trading i'm not still too hyped as if it was my se second year of trading i'm not still as hyped as if it was my first time of hearing about forex trading i already know about what i already know what forex trading is i already know how to make money in forex trading and at this point in time the greater the greater side of the triangle is the money the time i have the time to travel i have the t time to travel the world i have the time to do i have the freedom all right because here the time equates to freedom and the only thing i lack is the freedom that is why they say profitable forex trading is boring anytime you feel like you are still too excited with trading you are still a loser you are still a beginner when you, when you start feeling like it's, it's becoming boring that is when you know that okay you've become the profitable forex trader and you've be, you've entered in that realm of forex traders where you can make anything reasonable or you can make something like this in forex trading good so that was my third year you can see this is a circle right this is a circle it's like a life circle or it's like a balance not like a circle but it's a balance you need to be able to look for a balance between all these uh, all these different levels where you don't when you don't have the money but you have the time and the motivation when you have the time the motivation and uh, the money and when you have 
enough money, you have time and freedom, but you lack the motivation. How can you be able to look for a balance? Because if one of these, if you are not careful and just one of these leaves the equation, you go back to level zero. You go back to the first point. So now let's start at this level. This level is where I, is where I call, this is what? This is the learning. This is the learning. I can call this the learning level, right? Because at this level, you are still learning. And if you are still learning at this level, the best thing I advise you to do at this level, to look for a balance. Remember, we are looking for a balance between all these three levels, right? Or between all the three years. At this level, I call this year one is a learning year. You are still learning. So at this level, this is the highest time you should go for all the skis. This is the highest time you should be able to avoid everything that beginner forex traders do that end up blowing their accounts. This is a point where you should be able to set realistic goals. This is a point where you should be able to, to just have at the back of your mind that this is a long-term goal and you're not going to get rich overnight. So this is still learning. You still put, you're burning all the candles, you're putting in all the energies at this level, at this level, all right? Because you don't have the money, but YouTube is free. I have free, free, free courses on my channel. There are places where you can have free resources to start learning. That is where even if you, even though you don't have the money, but you have the motivation and you have the time. That is why you, you that is what you do at this level. You start learning you and you keep learning. At this, at this level, what do you see? At this level where you have the money, you have the time, and you have the motivation. How do you call this? I call this practice, all right? Practice. So at this level, you keep practicing. You keep practicing at this level. You've already learned on year one, or maybe this can be, maybe this can take you two years. I don't know, it just depends on individuals and time you are putting in every day. So let's just assume maybe this is your year, this took you two years, and this is instead your third year. But on this particular level where you have the money, you have the time, you have the motivation, what you keep doing, you need to know you you haven't arrived there yet. What you keep doing is practicing, practicing. Remember I say in forex trading, data is energy. Data is energy in forex trading in the sense that when you've backtested a strategy over and over and over and over and over again, you tend to know the drawdowns of that strategy. You tend to know the currency pairs you can trade that strategy on. You tend to know the market condition, the market sessions. So you tend to be able to synchronize with that strategy in social media. Even if somebody comes and tells you that, no, this strategy performs like this, you'll be able to stand and say, no, I have confidence in my strategy. Instead of being what we call a strategy prostitute, all right? A strategy prostitute is somebody that, okay, you get this strategy today, you test it, it doesn't work. Tomorrow you drop it, you take another one, you test it. Maybe you, you have a couple of trades that are winning, you drop it and you take another one at the end of the day you are just going in circles no pick one strategy test that strategy over and over practice so at this level you are practicing that strategy all those strategies over and over market conditions at least you need to be able to fine-tune the strategy to be able to feed your personality what is your risk appetite your risk tolerance all of that you are fine-tuning on what on year two or on this particular phase where you have the money the time and the motivation or when everything is equal now, when you've already arrived at this particular level where you have the money, you have the time, and you have the motivation, how, what do you do? Because at this level, this is, uh, at this level, this is, uh, we call this the learning phase, the practicing phase, the earning, the earning phase, all right? Because this is actually where you start earning. So on the earning phase, what do you do to be able to stay in the game? What do you do to be able to, to, to easily adapt, to, be, to easily adapt and be able to easily uh, point out if something is not working in your trading plan? What do you do at this level? Because if you get even to this particular level where you start making a couple of thousands in forex trading and you're not careful, you might come back to the you might come back to this level. You might come back to the to, to the level where you start learning everything. You might come back to the level where the money is gone, you have the time again, you have the motivation, and you start all over again. So to prevent yourself from leaving this area, from leaving this year, or from leaving this phase to this particular phase, you need to be able to do the following. First thing, first thing you need to do, you need to be you need to be what? Flexible. You need to be very, very flexible. Flexible in a sense that you should already have in, at the back of your mind that forex trading is a very dynamic industry. And as a dynamic industry, a strategy that is working today might not be working tomorrow. A strategy that is working today with particular parameters, there is no guarantee that same strategy will be working tomorrow with the same strategy or with the same parameters. You understand? So you need to have that degree of, that degree of flexibility within you to know that, okay, 
if something is not working, I can easily be, I can be flexible enough to easily spot what is not working in my trading plan, to easily spot what is not making me money again and easily adapt. So adaptation and flexibility is what you need to do. Adaptation, adaptation. All right. So flexibility, adapt, flex, flexibility and adaptation is a main thing you need to practice at this particular level. Because I won't be talking about the skis, everything. You've already learned that on your previous years, maybe the previous three years or the previous two years. At this level, flexibility and adaptation. Adaptation in the sense that wheresoever the market is going, you need to follow the market. That's why they used to say trade with a trend. We are not trying to reinvent the wheel in forex trading. The market is already there. If it's going to go up, it will go up. If it's going to go down, it will go down. There's nothing you can do. So we are not trying to reinvent the wheel. What we are trying to do is to follow the flow. As simple as that. What we're trying to do is to follow the flow. We are trying to follow where the money is. Where the market is going, that's where the money is. So you'll be able to do that if you are flexible and you are adaptive enough to easily adapt to the market changing environment. As easy as that. If you can practice this, you'll be able to remain in this quadrant. The reason why I remain on this, I remain on this particular quadrant, the reason why I'm still gonna be on this particular quadrant 100 years to come is because I practice these two skis flexibility and adaptation all right strategies that are working today tomorrow trust me if that strategy is not working i'll be quick enough to easily spot that okay there's something wrong with this strategy i need to know that i'll change the strategy but i'll be able to fine-tune the strategy i'll be able to adjust the strategy maybe if i was using high leverage i might step down the leverage or maybe if i was using a lower lot size i can increase so flexibility and adaptation will keep me on this particular quadrant forever all right so with that being said you can see this is a circle this is what i call what looking for a balance between money uh, time time which equates to freedom and motivation there will become a time where you have the time you have the motivation but you don't have the money there will be a time where you have the motivation, the, the motivation, the money, and the time in equal in, in equal amounts. If you have to wait, everything will be equal. There will be a time where you have the money, you have the time or the freedom, but you lack the motivation. That is very normal. That is what they call profitable trading. Profitable trading is very, very boring. All right. Pro profitable trading is very, very boring in a sense that you have you already know what is working you have already done it over and over you that means it's already repetitive in such a way that it becomes boring that is where the money comes in all right so with that being said we've come to the end of this video and i hope you've been able to pick some fun, some points from this video let me know on the comment section below which face of this uh, 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 market circle are you let me know which face you are the challenges you are facing and what i can do to be able to assist you all right so let me know in the comment section guys because recently my comment sections have been blown up with interactions and i used to reply to each and every comment on my uh, uh, channel so make sure you leave as many comments as possible make sure you smash the like button on the video if you've gotten something on this video guys make sure you smash the like button on the video uh, my course is coming up very soon at Golov University because you guys have always been asking something that you can do that can certify you and be able to call you a certified forex trader so I have the good news in about a week from now uh, my course will be dropping and you guys will be able to enroll and be certified as professional forex traders thank you guys so much for watching make sure you check the link below to be able to join my free discord community and also watch the videos that are going to be coming to the at the end of the screen check the link below to use the same broker that i use and to then i'll see you guys on the next video peace